What was that relationship like between you and Jay Cutler? Tumultuous. <laughs> <laughs> we had so many first experiences together and we had dreams, man. Like I remember our, after our first touchdown, us meeting in the end zone where we went to each other. And the first thing I said, I said, all right, we got 140 more to go. We're going to go after uh, Peyton Manning and Marvin Harrison's record. And then Josh McDaniels came in, broke that up. Jay Cutler was shipped to Chicago and that was the end of that. And then I got an opportunity, like you said, to go back to Chicago. He wanted to put the band back together. He brought in our offensive coordinator, brought me in. And it was awesome. The reality is he's a gunslinger. I don't think he had all the tools and skills he needed to really lead a team. And when you're in the NFL, that quarterback, you got to be like a CEO. I think he tried to develop that over time and it just couldn't, it could never come around. And it got to a point in Chicago, man, where those first couple of years he was hit so bad. It, it just seemed like it, it wore on him mentally and physically. And then we just didn't have enough to get it done.